हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू यूट्यूब चैनल क्रैक गेट ऑनलाइन सो दिस इज द थर्ड वीडियो रिलेटेड विथ टेरेसिंग सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस अबाउट द प्रीवियस ईयर गेट न्यूमेरिकल प्रॉब्लम्स एंड सम आल्सो प्रैक्टिस प्रॉब्लम सो अंटिल नाउ वी हैव डिस्कस्ड अबाउट द वर्टिकल इंटरवल विथ ऑफ बेंच टेरेस वॉट इज द अर्थ वर्क एंड सो इन दिस वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस हाउ दिस फॉर्मूला एंड हाउ दिस कॉन्सेप्ट विल बी यूज टू सॉल्व द न्यूमेरिकल प्रॉब्लम्स ओके सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू विल सी This is gate 2012 question. What is it asking? It is asking the lost area for half raised to one. So I showed you the direct formula for area lost. So numerator is same and denominator it will become half for as compared to one raised to one. So for one raised to one it is 200 plus s. So for half raised to one it will become 100 plus s. Directly you put the value of s and you will get the answer. Okay. so by putting the value of s as 10 you will get answer b so this is as simple as this so this i already showed you in case of earth work from where this 1250 is coming if you don't know how this 1250 is coming you please watch video 1.2 okay so once you know this you so this is inward sloping and this is outward sloping okay so in which case earth work will be higher okay so for this case outward inward sloping you need to discharge this extra amount of water so you need to give here one channel in the longitudinal direction so in this case earth work will be higher if earth work is will be higher then you need to add the value of slope here and in case of here you need to distract the value of s here okay so this is how technically you can remember the ws by 100 will be same but for outward it will become 100 minus s and 100 plus s for inward okay so this is a slight correction and this is the formula i already derived you and i already showed you how this comes okay so length of bench terrace how we will calculate so length i told you per hectare it is 10 to the power 4 divided by width of bench terrace okay it is for vertical cut what if it is 1 raised to 1 so 1 raised to 1 so in case suppose this is the triangle okay this is the cut and suppose this is 1 raised to 1 so for entire length same will be in here in this direction so 10 to the power 4 divided by this length plus this length okay so it will become twice of d by 2 that will become vertical interval or twice the depth of cut plus this is d by 2 w by 2 plus this w by 2 so that will become whole w so this is for 1 raised to 1 this is how you need to remember area of sorting also generally it is not asked but you can remember this formula if something comes in examination then you should have some idea okay vertical interval into length of bund per hectare multiplied by root 2 okay so this is 2011 question so here you can see it is asking earth work and the width so from option you can see you need to calculate only one parameter because all option is different there is no similarity in options regarding earth work and width so uh, read the question it is asking for half raised to 1 okay all the relevant parameter has been given so for half raised to 1 you know the formula for vertical interval what is vi here it is given as depth of cut okay 0.4 so what will be the value of vi here here what we is the value of d only it will become two times mean it will become 0.8 okay so here i have written 0.4 into 2 so our slope is given 16% all rest value you know you can calculate the value of w so from this question you can see how simple the questions related with terracing is here you just need to understand the concept and two marks will be yours definitely okay so this is option b 
and earth work you can also calculate 1250 ws divided by 100 you will get the answer so in 2014 also you have one question it is asking the earth work in meter cube per hectare for one raise to one batter slope and your hill slope is given so what is the earth work 1250 for one raise to one what will be there ws divided by 100 minus s okay So from WH divided by 100 minus S you can know the width and from here WH divided by 100 you can calculate the earthwork directly. So what will be the answer? Answer will be option A. Okay. So this is the basic formula for earthwork and from this uh, you are calculating a reverse 1250 into directly you can put this value here as well okay then you will get the same answer you can calculate by yourself and you can tell in the comment section what you are how much answer you are getting so basically if you know the vertical interval from there here it is not saying the depth of cut so you don't need to double that vertical interval so directly you need to put 2.5 okay and after that you need to calculate the earthwork so it is asking for half rest 150 batter slope what will be the drop the drop is nothing but the vertical interval so you know this is for vertical this is for 1 rest to 1 this is for half rest to 1 so what option you left you left only with option D the answer will be D this is practice question this is asking about the width okay so you know what is the width land slope bench slope and depth of cut everything is given so you can know that vertical interval is ws divided by 100 and for outward or inward it is outward so you will minus s minus s what if it is inward then you will add s plus s and here what will be the value of wi it is depth of cut multiplied by 2 so from here you can calculate you calculate the value of w and tell in the comment section okay so one more question is here it is last practice question and your this topic will be over after in the next video we will see about the broad best terrace so how you will can proceed for this so here it is asking design a bench terrace for inward sloping okay it is for inward sloping so what will be your direction direction will be like this and it will be your better slope and here somewhere in the outer side your shoulder bond will be there and from here this water will be it will be like this it will be one triangle okay so it will be one triangle and water will go longitudinally along this direction so you need to calculate vertical interval is given for how what is the riser slope or better slope it is 1 raised to 1 so what will be the vertical slope w is divided by 100 minus s you know the vertical interval you know the slope slope is 15 percent from here you can calculate the width okay now you know the width this is the width okay this is the width and what is this the base length of shoulder bund is also given that is bottom width is 75 centimeter means 0.75 what then what will be this width total width minus 0.75 okay so basically what i am trying to say you need to apply the manning's rough or manning's equation that is v equal to 1 by n r to the power 2 by 3 s to the power 1 by 2 that s is the slope of longitudinal slope longitudinal slope is given in this question it is given as 0.6 percentage for calculating the r 
you need to know the weighted perimeter so you need to know this distance as well as this distance what will be this height this will be equal to height of bond that is 0.3 and it is given as 1 raised to 1 riser so means this will become also 0.3 so you know now this length you know and you can calculate this length by Pythagoras theorem you know this width and you know this height so you know this length by Pythagoras theorem so you know the weighted perimeter you can calculate the area then a by p you can calculate the r you know the value of v now you need to calculate the discharge discharge is equal to a into v what is the a this is the area through which water is draining out means length of into width this is the area okay this this area will be of this this same area from this area it is going out not length into width okay this length into width will be used in the formula of peak discharge that is cia by 36 to rainfall intensity is also given as 20 and you need to compare the discharge by this channel q c q c by this channel what are your channel which is acting this terrace will be sufficient to take the discharge which is peak if it is able to take the discharge peak discharge if sustained by this channel discharge then your design is okay means your width is okay and your this height is okay 0.3 if it is not there then you need to reiterate you need to means basically your answer should be like QC means the discharge carrying capacity of channel should be higher than the peak discharge then only your design is good otherwise your design is not good because if this channel is not able to take the discharge then what is the meaning of designing this terrace okay so I think it is clear so in the next video we will discuss about the broad based terraces so from three videos you will be able to solve the numerical problems of gate and the theoretical problems of GRF in from broad based terraces there are not much questions in the gate what your questions have come in the examination I have taken in this video itself and further if you have any query then please do comment in the video thanks for watching this video have a nice day